Good morning, good people. It is Friday. Welcome back to the vlog. Uh, today is supposed to be a <clears throat> all cardio, non weight training day. However, um, <clears throat> in the spirit of protecting my back yesterday, and in the spirit of this morning, we're going to my lunchtime gym, which we kind of just recently joined. And I've been wanting to weight train at this gym, but I don't. I only do cardio because I'm on the lunch break and I don't have time. So that being said, um, I only did three exercises for my back, for my legs yesterday. So I'm actually going to do my 45 minutes this morning and maybe two leg exercises just to kind of check out the equipment and be sure I get a couple more exercises in. But why I really came on here was number one to enter a video. Number two, your girl before the gym is 140.6. So I do need to stop by the store. God, please don't let me get fat in rocks. Can y'all see me good? Let me see. <laughs> um, so I um uh, hopefully I'm get fat at store stopping by Safeway. I have to share my shredded lettuce with Daddy, so I need that for my nacho salad. Let me show y'all what I just turned on. So, I just turned on what wasn't on was my mirror. Just this light. Or just this light. So, that gave us a little bit more light. Outfit for the day. Nothing new, but the only thing that's new is the fact that I'm finally leaning out my upper body to where the back is um, bigging. And so now I can fit this little bra. That's it. All right, y'all. See y'all in the next clip. Hey, good people. So, I um, I thought I was watching TV, but apparently I was taking a nap. But I just got an amazing phone call from my brother that just made my whole life. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and eat. It's like 9 something. 9.16. I'm going to go ahead and eat just some green beans and some chicken. And then go get a foot reflexology. Um... I'll, I guess I'll just take this stuff with me um, as far as my pre-workout. Yeah, that's what I'll do. And uh, then probably go do round two straight from the foot reflexology. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Mm. That's it for now. All right, YouTube, forgive the angle, but I am about to make my rice tea. Um, I have not been doing a good job with keeping up on it because I'm not sitting at my desk and being consistent in that regard. So I just was a mess. So I'm gonna make this. I'm gonna do about five ounces of water. About two ounces of this caramel um, how do you call it shake three splendor packs I like it cold and then as I sip this I'm going to use my percussion gun on my legs and stuff and my glutes and then I'm gonna go get this reflexology an hour before cardio. But I wanted to show y'all kind of what it looks like and how I'm making it. Um, yeah, I just haven't been consistent because I'm not sitting at my desk and my, my schedule for the last few days have not been consistent. So we're getting it together. Serving is six grams. Definitely makes a difference with digestion, so I can't believe I've been slacking. Perfect. Do one little ice cube. And 
<laughs> yeah, I'm gonna sit here and enjoy this and then go get a get this body primed and ready for all this cardio. There's no preparing for all this cardio, but we do what we can. <laughs> All right, y'all. Hopefully, y'all can hear me over the um, people doing the lawn care stuff. Um, so I'm headed to go get my massage. Foot reflexology. I'm gonna do an hour. I have my pre workout with me, which this is just full of ice. I have a what flavor is this? Um, Comic Stardust Alani drink, and of course I have my uh, electrolyte. And in here I have a full scoop of Amino uh, uh, Humor Pro, a scoop of one scoop of Fat Burner, and some L Carnitine. And I'm gonna do a 90 minute session because. I finally see it, y'all. I mean, it's only been since December, but I finally see it. Your girl is excited. I didn't even call. I'm assuming during the weekday, this time of morning, they should have an opening. But as I head that way, I'm going to call. It might be in like 10 minutes. But yeah, that's what I'm doing. All right, good people. So I am now done getting my massage. About to make my pre-workout and then drive over to the gym, which would be about... I don't know, maybe a, don't spill. Damn it, piece of got on me. Maybe a 10, 15 minute drive, so give it time to start. Fuck me, and I don't have a towel. Oh my God, I'm so irritated right now. Like I don't have anything in here. Oh God, my ass is so wet. I am so annoyed. Like, so annoyed. Like, really? What's my deal? Am I that tired and that delusional right now? Um, anyway, Jesus. Anyway, so I'm making my pre workout. Back to that. It felt amazing definitely need it but you know how you wake up from massage you be kind of really tired delusional and it's just like oh god it's now the time to go do 90 minutes of cardio and i'm definitely planning on this 90 minutes of cardio being not a thing anymore after i check in in person hopefully he'd be like oh gosh you're so skinny go back to normal cardio which was 45 in the morning which is that's all i did this morning and four times a week five times a week round two was 60 minutes so let's hope we're back on that so anyway that's what we're doing for now a mess hey guys i am done with cardio 90 minutes done and dusted um i feel so good uh physically right now i think obviously because i'm able to rest more and take a nap before round two but at this point, your girl is just choosing violence. I, because my, well, I guess it's not a problem unless it's a problem, so it's not a problem, but um, because I am doing my round two later and there's a nap involved, I'm essentially eating all my macros in four meals when before it was like six. Um, okay, so I lied, it's not a problem per se. Ain't nobody mad but the devil, but. So this disregard, I'm just over here causing drama for nothing. We ain't choosing violence. It's working out. So I ate at nine for, and then I went and got the massage, and then I came to do round two, parking lot pimped a little bit. And then now it is 2.38, and I'm just eating meal three, which would be my lunch that I typically eat at noon or 12.30. Um, and then I'm going to have my last meal. So 
it is cutting down the cravings and again the macros are low so uh, it makes each meal just a big meal which again ain't nobody mad but the devil so whatever um y'all i might be coming out of a coaching retirement we'll see um one of the one of my shoulder training clients that i was um training here on instagram wants to discuss coaching and um for the right person me and daddy was talking about this he was like would you go back for the right person i would meaning the temperament is good um you know they understand accept my philosophy on prep and you know comp we're annoying competitors are fucking annoying we are annoying myself included and so i'm not in the place where i want to put up with a whole bunch of foolishness but she's really cool um her temperament is perfect she real grown not high like you can't be high maintenance and carrying on with yourself anybody got time for none of that um and she's definitely not like that so i think personality wise um i would definitely coach her so i guess once we do our consult and we um you know really lock in if we want to work together um we will but I, I would definitely coach her i like her personality um so if that uh moves forward i'll definitely let y'all know um so yeah i mean it's not my living so i could be very uh subjective with who i'm willing to work with and not saying i'm all letting everybody down to work with me either i i, I have had probably three other people reach out this season and want me to uh coach them but um i was working and it was just no way but now i guess i could pop you know again for the right person and the good match and a good partnership and the right temperament then i guess i would you know but anyway we're headed home y'all we about to get some food and it's bored this is what i meant to tell y'all so remember i told y'all how me and daddy have our own shelves we have our own drawer in the fridge like don't mess with my shit i won't mess with your shit i'm typically don't really care unless it's like my last of something but now daddy didn't want to take his shelf just way too serious but um so he ran out of shredded lettuce he had to confess see he was on my he was messing with my shit because he um so he ran out of Oh my God, lady! Just I don't care if you kill it here. Just get, just go in. Just please go in. I'm, I'm in a hurry. Lady, get your ass! Oh my God, I can't. She's trying to get in the gate, and clearly she's visiting somebody. But she could be a whole killer. I don't care. I'm hungry. Um. So he had to confess because. Oh my God, lady, get the fuck out the way. Um. He had to confess because he thought it was lettuce, so he put it on in his food, <laughs> and it was cabbage. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm like, see, that's what you get. Stay out my shit. So, real quick, I ordered a new pair of the ASIC Nimbus. Aren't they cute? Oh, whatever. I like this color. This is, I love these, y'all. ASIC Nimbus 25s. This is my third pair I've bought since December. I just sat here and did a whole, in my mind, two minute clip making my pre workout concoction. Well, it's made. Um, Pre-workout weight, 139.8. So hopefully I will be... Um, I'm not holding a lot of water these days. So I'm not dropping that much water at the gym. So I might be 139 even when I get back. But it would be lovely to see 138.8 or 138.6. But I feel like... 137.6 by Monday in person check-ins is possible. So apparently, um, and to be ready two weeks early was my wish, my goal. I don't know if I told Justin that, but um, apparently his goal was always for me just to be ready on time, which is fine as long as I'm ready. Um, so I'm feeling good. I still haven't bought my tickets, haven't booked the hotel, haven't done any of that. I'm gonna do the hotel stuff today. Um, I just really wanted to check in with Justin to make sure he's like yes we're gonna be 100 there but I'm I'm getting tired by the day so I'm gonna keep this extra 30 minutes in my D fluff work uh cardio until he tells me otherwise and um knowing Justin we may just keep it all the way through um peak week which I have the time to do it so I ain't mad at it anyway Let's see if I get fat between Walmart and Safeway before I get home. But let's hope. Um, I prayed on 138 something 
when we get back. Stay posted. Or stay posted. <laughs> stay tuned. Really quick. Oh, this is where I was going to tell you. Yeah, I'll turn this light on too. So, <clears throat> see this? So I keep seeing this in my videos and I hate it, but I keep forgetting to explain myself. So what had happened was when the people came to paint the bathroom, they took it off and they lost it. So then I ordered another one from Amazon, but when it came, it was too small. And if we met, we don't have time. So I actually did return it, which is a lot for me, but I, I can't be bothered, long story short. So it still looks like that. Um, but what I was going to show y'all was I have these magnetic lashes that today I'm going to have to try on to see if they still, if the glue is still good. This is probably two years old, these packets. This one I bought. This one a girl at work ordered from Amazon and didn't like it and let me have it. So what I like to do, because I suck at putting on lashes, I'm doing my own makeup. So I like to like maybe put on a magnetic magnetic pair of like smaller ones, um, not as dramatic, like maybe these or something like that, and then glue on top of those some like show lashes because I find it easier to glue um, lashes on top of lashes. Mine are so tightly curled. Um, I can't, it's hard for me to glue them. My makeup palettes are, this is the one I typically use for show weekend. Um, and I have another one that essentially has all of these base colors. I ordered my, um, my MAC Studio Fix. I ordered a new one because as y'all can see, this one is Dunzo. So that, I think, was supposed to be delivered yesterday, so I need to check the mail. I need to check my tan and make sure I have tanner today. Um, I need to check my Vassal Dry to make sure I have plenty of Vassal Dry. I need to get some more Vaso dry. Jesus, fix it. Okay, I have about this much. So that's enough for peak week. I'm gonna have to order another one at some point though for the next two shows. But I have enough for Charlotte. So I just need to check to make sure I have enough tanner. Because I have all my makeup. I need to take those lashes, make sure they work, and I should be good to go. Yeah. <laughs> This week I have romaine lettuce, fresh spinach, mini cucumbers, asparagus. I'm trying some fresh um, green beans that I plan to put in the air fryer and cook it and air fry it like I do my um, asparagus. So with my fish at night, do green beans and asparagus. I'm trying it. I don't like it. I got other green beans just in case. These are the French sliced green beans. These are the only ones I can really... It's a look thing. I like the way it looks better. I got fish, bear moody. I got... So last week I bought like old school whole tomatoes. And that's driving me crazy. And um, yeah, the texture me didn't like so much. So I went back to my normal little tomatoes and I'll probably just cut up like three with uh, when I eat it with my chicken and green beans. It's kind of like my way of like having 
uh, marinara sauce without actually adding marinara. So I just do the green beans and warm it up with it, uh, the tomatoes with it, and then kind of make it, you know, use your own What else? Uh, I'm done with dairy. After I go out of this, run out of this pack of fat-free cheese, I'm done with dairy for the remainder of this prep. The huge, all the popcorn rice cakes. And of course, chicken. And that's it, we just did a uh, Safeway today because we both are starting and ready to eat. So we just, we'll do Walmart tomorrow just to get like our toiletries and laundry detergent and you know, blah, 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 blah. So anyway, that's the grocery haul. All right, real quick guys, let me show you my suits um, before I get my day going. Um, wait, are these the new? Okay, so the bottles don't really matter, but um, so I wanted her to redo my uh, red suit because um, I wanted it to come up a little higher in the front. These these are the old bottoms. Um, I wanted to come up, but she went. She ended up making me a whole new suit and adding some oranges in there. I don't know if you can tell, but. Um, I wanted it to come up a little higher and a little smaller. For some reason, Justin just do me dirty, y'all. He be, he, he be snatching me dry. And I've never dropped as much weight during peak week than I do with him. So we had to, uh, I had to get new bottoms. So these are the new bottoms. KH Customs, of course. But you can see the design better with the top. So I'm either, each show I'm gonna wear something different. I want all my pictures to be different. Isn't that gorge? So that's suit option. I had her make these new bottoms um, to, so my pro debut suit was this. However, um, that was in 2017. Um, so I kept my same top. Stand by. So I kept the same top and just told her that um, I needed new bottoms, and so she recut them. This is what's crazy, y'all. This top was made in 2017. I have not lost one stone yet. I'm telling y'all, KH Customs, get you right. Ow, 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 my pull the dress. So I have my turquoise um, that I will do, and these are those connectors. And one of my faves. Uh, I do really well in the red though, but I'm just not a red girl. However, this is, again, this is the old suit bottom suit, but I do, it's like a fuchsia red um, fabric. And then we have pinks and uh, little red stones on there. So it's not so red, red. Um, but anyway, the other suit. It's like a purple blue fabric and then it has the pinks and blues and all the colors on there and we did new bottoms for this one so these are my suits that i am going to be rocking i'm going to give y'all a little look of all of them together so the plan is literally to wear a new suit a different suit for each show so my Instagram page is looking fire. Now I can show y'all better. Okay, so we'll eat. I'm gonna do turquoise at one show, this one at one show, and this one at the other. So you can see the orange and stuff in there better now. Isn't that gorge? Listen, KH Custom don't ever get it wrong for me. 2017, she made this top, and I have not lost one stone. Not one. Not one. Fully covered. Insane. This suit, she made me in 2020. I have not made, not lost not one stone. So when I go to shows, I have backup after backup after backup. 
Operation Clean the Girl Cave today. It's been worse, but I'm sorting laundry because I'm doing laundry right now. But yeah, that mess just happened. But yeah, I have no reason for the girl cave to look like this anymore. That um, I'm not working. I'm about to weigh myself to see what the post workout weight is. Y'all stay tuned. Let's hope I didn't get fat at the grocery store. I just can't. These 140s done had a chokehold. Then had a chokehold on you, girl. Lord, please. Maybe this bag might make it way more. Maybe I should take this off. Okay, y'all. I'm about to weigh. Stand by. I'm out of the 140s officially. I was hoping to be closer to 138. However, four ounces from this, I will be in a 138. So I can be 138 tomorrow, baby Jesus, which means I could possibly hit my 137.6 for check-ins on Monday. So, you know, so the body's done with the period water, like it's it's not really holding water, so I'm not losing as much at the gym. So I'm dropping ounces at this point. But you know what? The body can't win. You ain't holding enough water for me to see a big drop at the gym. I'm pissed off. You hold water, I'm pissed off. It just can't win. <laughs> but anyway, so we are now out of the 140s. That's my church dance. Um, I'll take it. I'll take it. So... I'll post the weight here so y'all see. I ain't lying. Not that I have to, but I ain't lying. We, we, we are officially out of one for So, listen. The goal tomorrow is um 138-ish. Um, I was going to go try to see Melania and stuff today. But see, I it don't take much to get me off track. So, I get to fucking around in these streets. I be off. So, I'm going to stay my butt on my side of town. Get my naps in, get my mush, my uh, matcha mushroom tea in. It definitely helped with bloating this morning. I hadn't had it in like three or four days, and I could see it. Um, I'm gonna be perfect because we, we, we're trying to be in the 138s tomorrow. So let's do this. Hey guys, alrighty, so I'm about to head to go do round two, another 90 minute round two. Um, Defluffing cardio is, when it's all said and done, it's an extra 30 minutes on my already prescribed cardio I had. And so I've been doing that since I got back from Vegas. Um, I'm going to do it today and tomorrow and then when he sees me in person monday we'll decide if i should keep it i'm down to do whatever uh we are we are we're we're, we're at the, almost at the finish line so at this point it's just whatever it takes um i showed y'all my suits um we did a grocery haul the scale got to 139 oh finally out of the 140s so we it should it just should keep rolling from here. So hopefully I'll see 139 ish tomorrow. I'm gonna check the mail right now. I think my Mac Compact, my Studio Fix should be. Is that bug in here or outside? Oh, it's outside. Oh Jesus, too much. Um, so I think that's in the mail. So I'm gonna check the mail. I'm gonna stop by DS Nutrition and get some of my amino energy energy drinks because I really like those. The Lonnie ones I think has more caffeine, so it makes me a little nauseous sometimes um what else oh when i get back i'm going to register for the show i have until the 30th you know what i think i'm gonna wait just in case until i see justin monday but i have until the 30th to register so i'm, I'm gonna do it then but i am gonna go ahead and book my not daddy talking about doing the show i can't keep going through this emotional roller coaster with him he's my some baby um what you think Should, can i jump in the show you know i used to coach him his first like four shows 
But I'm like, first of all, he's standing there butt naked. So, sir, what am I supposed to be focusing on? Like, I'm and I'm looking. He told me some up here, ma'am. Sir, it's just too much happening right now. Can you put on a panty or something? <laughs> this is too much. But now he's talking about doing the show. He said because he's bored. He got well, why not? He may as well just go. So who knows if it's going if he's doing it or not? I can't concern myself with all that. So I'm gonna probably well if he goes, we're gonna do Airbnb. If he doesn't go, I'm gonna book a hotel. So. I'll just wait till Monday and we'll do all that stuff. So anyway, I'm not going to hold y'all. We're going to go ahead and wrap this here. As usual, thank you so much for the support. I appreciate you more than you know. And I will see y'all in the next episode. Let's keep these views rolling so I can keep popping them out.